my name's Frank, uh, and I've started coming to Metro about, uh, about a year ago now, but um, I've grown up as a Christian, in a Christian family, um, never really went regularly to church, kind of on and off, you know, around Christmas and Christingles and Easter and things like that, but never really going that regularly, but always being a Christian. Um, but never really went to church weekly or anything like that. Um, when I came to uh, Bristol um, and, and started my job here for the first time about five years ago, uh, again, none of the guys that I worked with went to church or and none of my friends that I knew in the area at the time um, were churchgoers. Um, so I, I didn't particularly go then either, to be honest. I was prompted to, since meeting Beth, my wife, um, I, we're both Christians uh, and we talked about how we both actually quite would like to get more involved in meeting people who were like-minded you know, Christians as well and, and, and going, being a bit more involved in going to the church. Um, so we looked around and ended up finding Metro uh, by our woodies. Um, and came along, thought we'd give it a go. Um, and here we are today, really. Um, I think since I've been involved in the church community and coming regularly, uh, it's I've seen just much more benefit in just having more friends who are in the same kind of situation in, in their faith with me and having people to go through it with rather than just going through it all on my own. The reason I want to get baptised now is I was christened as a child, but now I essentially want to confirm that this is who I am and this is what I believe. I hope from getting baptised and giving that public affirmation and confirmation of my faith that I'll be able to use it as a springboard to kind of just really cement my faith and, and strengthen it and, and help both myself and, and Beth and, and just people generally that I, I know and care about in their own journeys as well. Hi, my name's Beth. I grew up in a strong Christian family and grew up in my faith and developed a really strong personal faith for myself through my teenage years. As an adult, I did some missionary work in South Africa and um, had a really good relationship with God at that point in my life. Unfortunately, some things happened which really damaged my relationship with God and made me question a lot. I was really angry with him for events that happened and knew that although he existed, I didn't know if I wanted to be in a relationship with a God that allowed unjust things to happen. For the longest time, um, I stopped going to church, being angry with God and just turning my back on the Christian scene. Um, and but about a year ago, Frank and I decided to look for churches and look for somewhere to start developing our relationship with God, not just kind of between the two of us and discussing privately and having more of a personal questioning relationship with God, making it a more trusting, open, community-based faith. Um, so about a year ago, we found Metro. I can remember my first Sunday at Metro really clearly, the worship in particular, um, just being in the middle of people worshiping God. Worship's always been a time with the music and with that time just connecting with God where God's spoken to me the clearest and where I felt his presence the most and I could, I don't know how to explain it other than I could just feel his love and just the community as well. I felt so welcomed and so at home and I knew on that Sunday that was, Metro was where I wanted to call like my home church. I want to get baptised today because I want to rededicate my life to God and know that 
I'm committing to him like I did to Frank on our wedding day, for better and for worse, whatever comes with the hard times and the good times. If you're feeling in a difficult place and don't know where God is in that moment, something really helpful that I was told is that God doesn't cause things, but he's there with you in them. And as painful as it is, God's heart is also breaking for you and he is just and he is good and he will always bring good out of the worst situations even where you don't think you can.